Hello, and welcome back to Stardew Valley Mod Review. There was a weird pause there. Um, I am today looking at another Halloween star mod. Well, I say Halloween star is Spirit's Eve. Do you expect to add stuff on Spirit's Eve, which is why I'm here on Saturday the 27th of autumn. I just need my rusty key and we can go. So, geez, this is an old uh, order save file. This will be one of my original ones. Um, not that you guys care. Ooh, that's a bit loud in my ear. Maybe it's not too loud for you guys. No, it doesn't look it. My voice is still much louder. And so, yeah. I realised that last week's update, I unintentionally made the update on the 5th rather than the 4th. Um, so that's great. But for those of us in England, remember, remember the 5th November, which is... And I'm recording, <laughs> but this won't be out till next week. So I need my rusty key to get into here. I have unlocked the hatch, I'll go in, and you may notice that down here is a bit more fun than it usually is. This is because of the um, Iron Crowbar, she have come during our festival of the mundane. Make sure to keep a, sh a shadow disguise on while talking to others. The rodent is unusual. of its unusual cuteness is selling more masks if you need them. And I sell a variety of rare and exotic goods even at the festival. On Fridays, I say silence as a sign of devotion to Yoba. Okay. Where was this? A mask of whatever. Maybe I should get it. Oh wait, I don't have a... Ah, inventory. Wish there's a quick way to do this. I don't know if there is. Maybe I'm just and I'm dumb, but I'll take it. Oh, if I knew that one, I've got got the one with the bow. Okay, so I put that on, and I look fantastic. This is a creepy human-like doll appears to gaze into your soul. Jokes on you. I don't have a soul. Woohoo! The festival of mundane, my favourite time of year. I don't think you guys can sell much. The, the aged horsey and void dip smells especially rancid today. Mmm. Now, now, humanlings, don't stray too far. It's time for our daily pilgrimage to the scroll dungeons. Between you and me, my friend takes this festival a little too seriously. Do they just repeat the same stuff? If you behave, I'll let you choose which tomb you'll be forced to read here. <laughs> I love getting into character. The festival mundane is the best. Now. Is that meant to be Penny? I think this is meant to be Elliot. I don't know how I prepared myself. Just zoom in. That's almost definitely Penny and that's definitely Elliot. I don't know who you're meant to be. You're Jazz. Anyway, where's the good slush ale? Between you and me, my friends take this festival a bit too seriously. I think you're Shane. Look, nine, 99 pints of good slush on the wall. 99 pints of good slush. Take one down, pack it around. <laughs> you take one down, you pass it around. 98 pints of good slush on the wall. <laughs> oh, don't tell me. Let's go. Yeah, it carries one down. Oh. If that generally goes down to one, I am impressed. I'm not going to sit here and flip it. This pumpkin has been sliced into witches and served raw. Crunchy. You've got banana peel on your head. I don't know how the humans keep their balance on these things. Oh, you're, um, yes, Blondie. What's his name? Especially with banana peel on their head. Oh, what is his name? I'm so great remembering the names in this game. I'm going to have to check on the social thing, if I can get the right menu up. It's him that I don't have ticked off because I never met anyone. Not Alex. Oh, I might have Stardew Valley up in the background. Not Stardew Valley, Sundrop City. Well, I can't find the person I'm looking for. But it's him. That's Alex. Hey, do you want to toss around this odd-shaped tuba? Yeah, I didn't think so. Humans have weird habits, don't they? Do you guys only know what humans are from looking at the town off a bill? Because, well, the village up above. Because it's not a good thing. 
step right up and play a game of pin the nose on the goblin prizes and who've gone pumping and void void egg. Only one of each prize per customer though. I'll have a look at that in a minute. Sebastian? Hey, do you mind taking a few steps to the left? Okay. Now what? <laughs> You're in my blind spot. Pound, pound, pound. Supposedly this is the way that humans reveal to one another the true essence of their being. Okay. The creepy human-like doll appears to gaze into your soul. Oh, that's that doll. Uh, I'm not sure how pounding things with a hammer is supposed to reveal my true essence, but it's worth a try. A lot of creepy dolls. There's a lot to see. Ho ho ho, hello, stranger. I sense something different about you. That's the goblin. Don't you worry, though. My fighting days are long gone over. Your secret's safe with me. Does everyone just come down for the day? I want to see a rare green smelly fish. Say, so, dude, Dad really would clean up your water a bit. Who do we have here? Piss, quit bothering me. I'm making sure no one's not nose humans come poking their nose in where they don't belong. Well, I'm totally one of you guys. Woo, check out these moves. That's just... I have no idea who that's meant to be. I sleep glasses, so maybe Elliot? I'd ask you to dance, but these glasses are kind of making me motion sick. Why are you wearing them? This creepy hoon there. Yeah. I think I'll take a breather. I won't wait to and twirl and spin and whoa, I'm getting dizzy. Ugh, I see double. Yay, I heard the dance is really popular with some of the monsters in school caverns. Yeah, dig those mummified moves, man. Walk like an Egyptian. Damn, dance like a gy gypsum. What does that even mean? Okay. <laughs> My boyfriend is so embarrassing. Wait. Um, okay. Been wanting to dance this guy for a while, but his moves are a bit aggressive. I tried to cut in, but I ended up with an arm turned to the face. Abigail. Toot toot, I brought this flute prop this year so that nobody will ask me to dance. Wise move. You understand the whole dance thing, nor will I. I put, your, I put my costume off. Of course, Lewis, of course. <laughs> Luckily I found these purple shorts in a bush outside. Oh dear. That's probably a reference to the... Yes. Did I look at everything on there? Lukewarm void at a lowly with horseradish leaf for dipping. Dipping. Pungent. Is that it? Okay, so see what's down this way? Hey, that's really nice. You in the bathing suit costume you're wearing. You sure you want to get in the... Uh, all the wet gets it all wet in the pool. I totally do. Let's see. Who do we have to talk to here? Don't tell anyone, but I'm not wearing a bathing suit right now. Something. Sometimes it feels like strip yourself of all the societies. I'm leaving. <laughs> I don't care what anyone else says. Taking a bath in my favourite part of the festival of the mundane. I mean, you don't do it any other time of the year. You can feel the filth of the world just wash around as the water envelops you. Well, it is nice, okay. I was hoping you could sort of sneak through there. I don't know if it's intentional, but the water sounds slower. As the season comes to close and the weather gets colder, it's sure nice to take a dip in a nice warm pool. Eek, something brushed up against my leg. Wait, no, it was just some oh, fish bones. Oof. Ugh, I decided I accidentally swallowed some water. Sorry, I had a piece of corn lodged in my throat. How do you do? Yeah, I think I'm gonna get out and go back to normal speed. Okay, so I did look at everything. Obviously, I can't. Oh, I missed this person. The shadow girl is pretending to ignore you. The shadow girl is still pretending to annoy you. It's taking every ounce of the shadow girl's willpower to continue. You. The shadow girl is blushing, but still very much ignoring you. The shadow girl is pretending to ignore you. Okay. Look, I did not talk. Creepy human like doll appears to gaze into something. It's a pity I didn't click on one. The shadow girl is still pretending to annoy you. Okay, so she's just ignoring me apparently. How could she but she how could she ignore me? How wonderful. Okay, so let's talk to this dude and play a game. I didn't get enough. I have no idea.
Okay. So it's just... You're blindfolded and will automatically lose life and life based on hints. Okay, so let's me to move right, go left. Okay, that's better. I got a strange bun. So it has... As I said, it ha you get a couple of prizes, but we're going to try and do it all night because th that was a bit disconcerting. Felt like I was wearing his glasses. But yes, this is the Festival of the Mundane. We have a ton of people who suspiciously look a bit like members of the valley. Just a tiny bit. Just a tiny, 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 tiny. This seems in far. Just a little bit like people I know from the valley. Anyway, so that's it. Um, that's all I'm going to have a look at. Thank you for watching. Like if you like, subscribe if you can. Please leave comments. I enjoy reading comments. Um, tell me I'm awesome if you think I'm awesome. Tell me I'm terrible if you think I'm terrible. Check out my other videos. I do quite a few mod reviews. Um, well, <laughs> I say reviews. I have a look at a lot of mods. And last but not least, this is Missy signing off. Goodbye.